Hello ladies and gentlemen, Jim here. The San Francisco Department of Public Health is on pace to open two safe injection sites this July, which could become the nation's first legal safe injection sites aimed at curbing the opioid epidemic. The facilities are considered safe spaces where drug abusers can inject drugs such as heroin and fentanyl under the careful supervision of trained medical staff to respond to the event of an overdose or other medical emergencies. While San Francisco Mayor Mark Farrell believes the controversial facilities are not the ideal solution, he thinks the city has no other choice in arresting the out-of-control overdose deaths ravaging the region. Now other cities including Seattle, Baltimore, and Philadelphia are discussing safe injection facilities with their community leaders, but San Francisco could be the first in the next few months. For some time now, facilities in Australia, Canada, and Europe have been providing a friendly environment for drug users to chase the dragon. Now on a side note, more than 63,000 people overdosed and died in 2016, according to the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, which is more than the number of Americans killed in Vietnam. Over the next decade, it is projected that half a million people will overdose and die in the United States, exceeding the number of Americans killed in World War II. Uh, the opioid epidemic, ladies and gentlemen, this is not to be taken lightly. Uh, it, it, this, this is an epidemic, and somehow there's got to be a stronger word, a stronger phrase for this. Now, what do you think of this? Is this a good idea? Should there be these heroin uh, or fentanyl in, injection sites that are safe, that are friendly, that are uh, supervised by medical professionals? Is this a good idea? Or is this just exacerbating an existing problem and encouraging more illicit drug use? What do you think? Uh, you certainly can comment below, folks. I will leave you a link to this. I would ask you please to subscribe to my channel. If you haven't done so already, please give this video a thumbs up. Please share it if you feel so led to. And... Um, I'd ask you please to check out a few links below the video if you would. One is to my latest fiction book, Fortress, A Wayfarer Story. It's fiction the deep state does not want you to read. There's a link to a free read of chapter one. And I have a new book I am working on right now, which is a follow-up to this. Can't wait to get it done for you. There's a link to some music of mine and also a link to a PayPal page if you want to buy me a cup of coffee or give me a tip. I appreciate you, ladies and gentlemen, and I want to continue to remind you these are perilous times within the maelstrom that we are living, but do not be given over to the spirit of fear, but instead of the power of love and of a sound mind that comes through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God bless you.